Rock 17 Rock Interview. I'm hanging out with the talented bluesman, Travis Bowen, singer, songwriter, maker of cigar box guitars, endorsed by Dean Guitars. Oh, and, yeah. and today you're on here with me on the Rock Interview talking about neck illusions. Neck illusions. So what can you tell me about these? You, uh, you, you use these on all your guitars. Well, and, I, and I'll say on that one, it looks incredible as well with your name. They, they call it an illusion because everybody thinks uh, it's actually inlaid. My name's actually inlaid. They're always like, oh, that Dean made you that, that special guitar. Yeah. I'm like, well, it's like two endorsements in one. <laughs> um, my friends, Neck Illusions, I met them at the Summer NAMM show here in, here in Nashville. Yeah. And uh, basically what this is, it's, it's a, a protective uh, cover for your, your fretboard and it gives it a little bit more attitude, a little more, more design, a little bit more personality. Totally. And uh, it's, it's 0 0.005 fifths of an inch. Yeah, you can't and even tell it when it's on the fretboard. You can't, and they've tested it in the studios with and without it, and there's no change in, in tone or sound. And uh, it's a, a patent-pending micro-woven material, mm -hmm. so it's not a, a paper sticker. Right. There's other you know, companies on the market that'll say a paper sticker, but yeah. this is going to last you for a very long time. Um, in They'll, they'll put whatever you want on there. Well, you know, they've got so many cool designs, too. So and I, and, many. And, and we put on the, we, you know, did some of the guitars here to where they sent, you know, the Rock and Review one. Yeah. And so, you know, we can see some of those. They make them for bass guitars. Uh, you know, I put the Mona Lisa on my Yamaha Silent. Yep. When you see that one down there, everybody's like, wow, you got the Mona Lisa on your guitar. Yeah. And they make them for ukuleles and I think uh, banjos and mandolins they'll also. They'll go to a 12-string as well. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it's... It's low and adhesive on the back, so you have no residue. Nothing, nothing right. stays behind when you peel them. And uh, they, they recommend changing them or updating them, cleaning, conditioning underneath the uh, fretboard about every thousand hours of playing. Right, or, or, or six, six months. months. Yeah, that's what they were telling me. I, I have a set where, I mean, I wore them out. I mean, I play, you know, 250 shows. I play yeah. the guitar. I mean, they're worn out. Because you're a hard playing blues yeah, man. Yeah, I try every day. <laughs> and, and one cool thing about them, by the way, is like if you are if you play a lot at the th first three frets uh -huh. and say you just wear out one or two, they'll replace just that one really? or two. Really? I didn't know that. And it's very affordable. Yeah. It's very affordable to take your guitar to another level and make it something that no one else has. Right. So, and, and that's what I like. You know, it's like we even brought in, as an example, you know, uh, one of my tellies to where, you know, once you put on the the neck illusion here on the fretboard and then you can actually lean it up here and so that's how this looks beautiful on yeah there. it looks like it was made that it's just way like awesome yeah and they go on easily and and like you were saying too travis i like them because they don't do any damage to the fretboard and so you're not going to damage your instrument they come right off very easily, easily and you can reuse them again and they'll fit uh basically any they, they try to retrofit uh you know 25.5 inch scale to right. 24 points and, and they'll do classical scale. guitars and 12 yeah. string. So they'll, they'll get them to match up there almost perfect, almost one size fits all. So that's, that's a really cool thing that right. they have. You and, know. You can, and you can find all the uh, current ones they have. You know, if you don't want to go for a custom design like Travis's, they've got like, uh, here you go with the Van Gogh artwork. Um, they've got all those on neckillusions.com. Yes, and also if you're on there and you find something that you like, you can use coupon code BOLIN15 and you can save 15% on your orders. So, there you go. That's, so that's a good pitch. It's, it's great. I mean, <laughs> they're, they're a really good company. They yeah. got a cool product. So the thing I like is when I'm working with something that I like, it's good to like the people who oh, are totally, making it totally. too. You now, know? speaking of which, you know, talking about liking things, I've been listening to your uh, tracks. You know, and you've got some great new blues music thank out right you, now, man. Thank you so And so much. let's talk a little bit about your singles, and you've got a new one coming out soon. We, uh, a few years ago, I was lucky enough to raise about $10,000 for my fans. I have some great fans. Every time I come up with an idea, they're usually there to help support it. Yeah. And uh, we, we never really got a budget together to work the whole record. And unlike a lot of artists who drop a record and never have any marketing, it just sits there. Right. I thought, well, look at that, Bad today, Bad Man. Bad right Bad there. Man was the first single we released uh, that March, and uh, that kind of started the right. snowball effect. And after that, we released Got the Goods. Right. And then the I last like single well. we released was See You Again, which we had that as uh, number three on uh, 
the Roots Music Report. Now this, this is my favorite track of yours. I gotta tell you, it reminds me like meeting like blues with like uh, like old free or bad company yeah, almost. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's got a good feel it's to it. It's the new blues today. Yeah, you know, it's a it's, very modern feel. It's, it's, you know, and that comes from me being 27. You yeah. Know, but I have a lot of friends in my life who've been older than me. Right. So you have that influence, but uh, See You Again, we had that on the entry ballot for possible Grammy nomination, wow. American Roots Song, American Roots Performance. Um, that was produced by my buddy Nolan Neal. He sang with Hinder for a little bit. He's oh, working yeah. on trying to be the new Stone Temple pilot singer. And, That's amazing. Um, we recorded at a studio that no longer exists in Nashville right. because they turned it into a condo. But yeah. uh, Well, and you've been here in Nashville for what? About three, three years. Three years yeah, now. So, so, so when is the next song and when do you think the album will come out? We're working a budget to get the next single out because uh, I... Uh, I we worked the last single so much, you know, yeah. I kind of got sidetracked with playing out all the time. <laughs> you, you gig a lot. I do. I try to go out four or five days. I think uh, since October, our band van, I put about 15,000 miles wow. on it. So um, we're going to be releasing uh, the next song, which is going to be uh, So Wrong, Too Long, which be the next single. So uh, hopefully we'll have that um, work with my uh, uh publicist to right. get that out sometime. In now, the where can viewers uh, find you online and on Facebook and all that stuff, Travis? They can go on my website. It's travisbolin.com. They can uh, find me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Now, is that uh, where they, where can they buy the singles, too? They can buy the singles on anywhere you can, you can get music, whether it's iTunes or Google Play. Okay. Uh, if, you, if you're on Spotify and you'd like to just put it on a playlist, I can still get like one eighth of a penny that way. <laughs> So, I mean, it's a hustle. And it all helps. It is. It's all yeah. hustle. As long as you got pennies, multiple pennies coming in, they <laughs> it end up being dollars. Oh, my gosh. Well, I'll tell you what. Great music, man. Thank I'm, I'm really looking Thank forward to coming so out and seeing you live myself. Thank you. Because I'm a huge fan of the blues. And uh, thanks to Travis Boland for coming out and talking about neck illusions. And uh, be sure and catch him on the road and buy those new singles. I'll tell you what. He's going to have some more great music coming out. Thanks for watching The Rock Interview. Thank you.